Welcome back to my channel. Today, I have a special treat for you budget-friendly, tasty, and quick rice with seafood. No need to go to fancy restaurants when you can enjoy this amazing dish right at home. You need parsley, egg yolk, soy sauce, red pepper, yellow pepper, green pepper, mushrooms, garlic paste, salt and pepper, salmon, squid, shrimp, and some flour, seaweed, rice already prepared and cooled down. Now we can start. Cut the peppers. They are high in vitamins, especially vitamin C and vitamin A. Antioxidants, fibers, and low in calories. They promote eye health, aid in weight management, boost immunity, support heart health, and enhance digestion. Slice the pepper half vertically into thin strips. Gather the strips together and cut them horizontally to create small square-shaped pieces. Cut the carrots. Carrots are good for you because they are rich in vitamin A, packed with antioxidants, promote heart health, support hydration and weight management, and have good nutrients. The full recipe details, including quantities, macros, is available on my website. www.leeforkeautv.com Cut the mushrooms. Mushrooms are good for you because they are nutrient-rich, contain immune-boosting properties, provide antioxidants, offer dietary fiber, and are low in sodium and fat. By boiling water and adding seaweeds and soy sauce to create your dashi. Seaweeds are rich in umami flavors and are commonly used in dashi to enhance its taste. My version of dashi with seaweeds and soy sauce will likely have a rich and savory flavor profile with a hint of oceanic notes. Cut the salmon fillet into cubes of the desired size using a sharp knife. Salmon has omega-3 fatty acids, high-quality protein, and essential vitamins and minerals for heart and brain health. Cut the squid body into cubes by holding it flat on the cutting board and slicing it crosswise. Low-calorie, protein-rich, and a good source of vitamin B12 and minerals with anti-inflammatory properties. Cut the shrimp into cubes by making even-sized cuts. Shrimps have lean protein, low in calories, contain selenium, vitamins, and antioxidants for overall health. After cutting the seafood into cubes, the next step is to coat them evenly with flour. Cook the seafood cubes for a few minutes on each side until they turn golden brown and are cooked through. Add the vegetables to the pan along with garlic paste. Season with salt and pepper if needed. Cook the veggies until they are cooked through and tender. Add the cooked rice to the pan and demix it well with the seafood and veggies. Mix the egg yolk into the rice mixture. Incorporating it thoroughly. Finally, add your homemade dashi. To enhance the flavors of the dish, sprinkle some parsley on the top. Before you go, don't forget to check the video description for detailed calorie information. Thank you for watching and happy cooking!